button. This is a video how to load the Driftless Glassworks hand foiler. This is the size that fits up to 1 4th inches. Okay, so on your foiler, there are two slots. There's one here and then this portion right here. So I will take my foil and then I usually leave it off a little edge there so I can easily go like this. Okay. Now I do something a little different than what others might do. I take a piece of the backing and I rip that off and then I'll put that on the front part here, the top edge. That way I can use this so it doesn't stick when I guide it through. And then I just separate it a little bit. So the backing of my tape goes in the slot and then you push it out the back here. So through and then in the back, so I secure it with my finger there. And then this piece, the top portion with the tape, okay, I just load that through the channel here. And then I grab onto it there. Try to pull out the kink if I've kinked it at all. And as you can see, while I pull, it separates your foil. See how it's separating? There's the sticky side. Okay. The next part, I put it behind the wheel up there, or the bearing. And then I just pull it along. And so I'm gonna remove the backing that's on here. have my piece ready to foil. Okay, so this is a quarter inch foil. You can see how it doesn't stick to the channel. It's lined up nice. The tail of the backing is sticking out there. So then I would, I generally line this up using the guide, but I also use um, a little bit of time here to make sure that when I start it's lined up, especially right after I load the foiler. Okay, so you have it even on both sides. And then I use the bearing here as pressure to help line it up nicely and get a nice stick on there. And then see how my glass is lining up with the channel? That's one method to keep your glass foiled nice and even. I go kind of slow just so I can watch but as you go you can probably get a lot faster especially if you're not recording at the same time. So I usually do a little overlap and double check my alignment. So it looks pretty good on both sides.